Hello and welcome to another edition of Five Minutes with God, a youth Bible study here on the Cary Baptist Church YouTube channel. I hope you have had a fantastic week. Get yourselves cosy if you're on the bus. Get yourself in somewhere where you can listen and concentrate. If you are doing this at home, grab your Bible, grab your pens, grab your paper. Now, today we are only going to look at one verse of the Bible. We are going to be reading one verse from a very famous psalm. Unlike last week where we had a few verses to unpick, we're going to spend some time just looking at this one. So you're going to turn to Psalm 119 and you're going to find verse five, uh, 105 even. And it reads, your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. It's very important that when we find ourselves in a situation where we feel lonely or separated from the people that we love, that we hold on to the idea that we have God at our fingertips, that we have his word right there in front of us. The words in the Bible are God's words to us in everyday, normal life situations. You know, the Bible might have been written 2,000 years ago, in situations that we can't put ourselves in, we aren't carpenters, we aren't kings of Israel, but we are human and so are the people in this book. And so when we feel separated from the people that we love and the people that love us, which we all do sometimes, everybody gets lonely, we should remember that we have our father's word there ready for us to pick up. While we're home alone, whilst we're sat on the bus with our headphones in and everybody else is chattering around us and we need five minutes break. When you're sat in your house with your brothers and your sisters and you go, no, you're too much right now. I need to be alone. Then it is a great time to take a moment to open up your Bible and find where God is speaking to you. Now that might be you don't know where to start so you just open the Bible and you read wherever it lands. Or you might choose to find a story that you've not read in a long time. Or you choose to go to one of those books that we always joke about the names being so bizarre but that you've never actually read. Maybe you want to open Habakkuk or Nahum, Haggai, Malachi. It is up to you but when you need a moment... Remember that you have God's words at your fingertips. We aren't always able to spend time with the people we want to, but we have the opportunity to always spend time with God. His word guides us through our every day. And actually, we've lived through a period of darkness, of uncertainty. We didn't know what was happening. And at times we still don't know what is happening. We have lived through history. But we got through. We got through because we had God. We got through because we had one another. We got through because we could rely on the fact that we knew our father was listening when we just needed to scream at someone at three in the afternoon when all we wanted to do was see our friends. And I want you to take that and put that into your everyday life as things become a little bit more normal again. Lean on God. Lean on God as much as we did through that period of uncertainty. Lean on God every single day. And when you don't know how to do that, pick this up. Pick up your Bible, open to a random page, a random story, wherever you want to be. And lean on the words that you read. Let them be the lamp to your feet. Let them show you where God wants you to go. So I want you this week to make sure you pick this up more. And even if you open it on a random page and you read a random story or a random verse, 
or you go to a story you know when you need it remember that god is right there and ready to say something extraordinary to you